How to add openings and accessories to the curtain wall. In this chapter, we will show how to quickly and easily place a window and door on the curtain wall. We will add sunshade to the building, which will associatively connect to the curtain wall grid system. Activate the first preset view located in the Chapter 5 folder. Activate the next preset view to open the 3D window. This view shows the main elevation of the building. Select the curtain wall and enter the edit mode. Select the top left glass and open the panel selection settings dialog. Change the generic panel to curtain wall window. Go to option, opening direction and change it to outside. Keep the previously selected window and select the hot spot on the opening direction line and set the top direction to 90 degrees. Pick up the properties of that window and copy them to the main glass panels on the first and second floors. Let's open the top left window. Select the window and click on the hot spot at the bottom. Press tab and set the horizontal opening angle to 20 degrees and then press enter. Select and delete the three frame parts on the middle of the ground floor to merge the panels for the entrance. Select that panel, go to Settings and first choose the curtain wall revolving door. Press OK to exit the dialog. If you would like to change this door to a normal double door, just select it and choose curtain wall double door. Set the opening direction to outside. Now, let's place some sunshade above the entrance door. Activate the Curtain Wall Accessory tool and open the Settings dialog. Choose the Sunshade 1 favorite. Draw the reference plane between the chrome panels on the fourth grid. When you click to finish the drawing, you will get an eye cursor. Choose the external side to place the shade. Zoom and orbit above the sunshade. Select the two parts in the middle and delete them. Select the sunshade on the right and click on the left hotspot which is connected to the curtain wall and stretch it to the vertical profile. Repeat the same steps with the other one on the left. Now select both of the sunshades and switch to the settings dialog. Set their parameters. Change the arm thickness to 60, arm length to 1500, and set the panel's number of louvers to 8. Press OK to accept the changes. Keep the editing mode active and zoom out to see the right side of the building in order to place more sunshades. We will place sunshade on the second grid from the top. We'll use the properties of the sunshade 1 favorite which was activated previously. Place sunshade on the left side of the curved part. Navigate to the curved wall, continue placing it, and finish it at the right side of the curtain wall. Zoom back to the beginning of the sunshade on the left side. ARCHICAD starts the sunshade at 45 degrees because of the negative corner in order to facilitate joining it to the other part on the perpendicular side. Now we will finish the shade at the corner with 90 degrees. Let's modify the first sunshade part. Select it and click on its hot spot in the end. Rotate the left side of the sunshade and click on one of the grid points on the perpendicular side. 
Click OK on the curtain wall editing menu to accept all changes. Activate the next preset view to finish this chapter and see the 3D model. This completes Chapter 5. We've seen just how easy it is to place openings, copy them or change them to another type. Simply merge panels by deleting frames and then change the type to an arbitrary opening. In addition, it takes just a few seconds to add sunshade.